Hi friends, this is Yom from Civil Center. Welcome to our channel. As you know, Civil Center is continuously working with a vision to guide civil engineering students and professionals. And in this series, we are making a number of YouTube videos on various softwares. We are also open for our live online classes. If you want to join our live online classes, you can find the details in the description box. Now let's come back to today's video. So, if you are our regular viewer, then you must be knowing that I have started a series on Tecla Structures, which is a detailing software. I have made a number of videos on Tecla Structures in RCC Detailing. But today, we are going to start a new series and that is on Steel Detailing. So, what we are going to learn in today's video? In today's video, we will learn how you can join two plates using the bolts. So, without wasting the time, let's learn. This is the interface of Tecla Structures and for our convenience, I have already prepared the final results. So, I have joined two plates using the bolts in linear arrangement and also in circular arrangement. Now, let's learn how we can do it. So, at first, we need two plates. So, I will go to steel and then select plate. So this is our plate. Now, since we need two plates in the perfect alignment, all I will do is I will just copy it. So I will select the end point and copy it to the top. So now I have two plates. For the better visualization, I will just change the color of one of the plates. So now you can clearly see that we have two plates. Now that my plates are ready, I can provide the bolt. So I will select the two plates and hit the scroll button of my mouse and look for the midpoint of the top plate. And you will see we have provided a bolt over here. Now what we have to do? We have to change the properties. So I will click on interrupt and then select the bolt, double click on it and then go to the array and here I will set the pole distance in X direction and in Y direction. So I'm just providing the distance and you can see that our bolts have been provided. Now that we have our bolts, then we need to position it correctly. So I will go to the offset from x-axis because this is the x-axis so i need a offset from this so i will provide a distance of 150 and you will see that our bolts are correctly positioned now now how you can provide the bolts in linear arrangement for that all you need to do is to select it click on copy and position it you can see you have the arrangements. Now you have to select the bolts and change few properties. Like in the bolt group, you have to change it to circle. Then you have to provide the number of bolts as six or any number that you want. And for the diameter, we will keep it 300. That's fine. Now, what we need to do is to provide the distance from the axis. So this is our x-axis and from here we will provide a distance of 300 mm and you will see it has been perfectly centered. So this is how you can provide bolts in your plates in array and in circular form. So that was all for today. If you want me to make videos on any particular topic on Tecla structures, then you can comment in the comment section. If you like this video, hit the like button, share it with your friends and colleagues and subscribe to our channel. And one more thing, if you want to join our live online classes, you can fill the Google form that is given in the description. Thank you.